Here we are at Vandalia Glass Works in South St. Paul. Over here is what's called the glory hole. It's where we reheat the glass as it cools down. This is the glass furnace. This is 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit. This melts the molten glass in a big crucible, and that's where we'll take our gather of hot glass on the blowpipe. Blowpipes are over there, heating up and preheat the tips so it doesn't shock the metal before we dip into the glass and twirl it to scoop up or gather the hot glass. Here we've prepared our colors. We've got colored shards that have been blown out from sticks of colored rod and then broken up and they'll be rolled into the molten glass. These are fine chips, also colored glass, just in a finer chip form. Our logo is a stencil that we've sifted blue, cobalt blue powder. And so that is glass powder as well. That'll be melted onto the surface after we gather the colored shards. Alright, so here I'm going for my second gather of open glass. Again, this is 2500 degrees. I'm twirling the pipe and it's gathering and collecting up on the end of glow pipe. Cool. Just going to cool it down a little bit here. Alright, now we're taking the fresh gather and rolling it into the colored shards. You see the crack, some of them stick. I'm gonna roll it into the chips on top of that. And this will layer up on the clear glass. Now we have to go melt it and heat that back in in the glory hole. Ready. Alright, now I'm at the glass bench. I've got some wet newspaper that lets me shape this. You can see the steam keeps the paper from burning. Alright, here we go. So now I'm heating the glass up again. I'm going to pick up the stencil. Laying it down there and letting the glass press down onto the powder. Now when I pick it up, there's the logo man. Now we're going to heat it up again and melt in the powder. Okay, so now the glass is cooled down. You can see it's not moving anymore. I'm going to dip into the furnace and take another gather. And encase the whole piece in clear glass. glass is cooling down and I'm going to put a neckline in where we'll break it off. The pipe once it cools down. So the glass is still pretty hot. All right, now the piece is cooled down and we're gonna break it off. And we're gonna heat, heat the bottom up to get it flat. So the glass is thick enough and has enough heat that it won't crack for a little while. It gives me time to heat the bottom. Take 
some nice gloves here so I don't burn myself. And now we put it into an annealing oven and cool it down slowly. Now here is the finished piece. It stayed in the annealing oven for over 24 hours to cool down slowly and relieve any stress. What comes out is a beautiful one-of-a-kind piece of art with swirling colors and glowing blue body. I appreciate the opportunity to create such a unique award. Feel free to visit my website, peterzell.com. If you have any questions, you can email me there. Thanks and enjoy. Thank you.